Right, this is the basic program and uh, you'll be adding your points, uh, changing your speed and making your move commands. There's a few um, dialog boxes that will be helpful. You'll want to, for your I.O. control, you'll want to have uh, your digital I.O. This button here. And this will be your outputs, this will be your inputs. And you can turn them on manually. Not the outputs, but... Or not the inputs, but the outputs you can turn. You'll want to have your your variable manager and under variable manager is precision points. Precision points is one of the easier ways to um, set points um, if you're going to have a specific pickup location, drop location, height or whatnot. Um, precision points is, is the easy way to do it. Um, to create precision points just right click choose create. Um, make sure the type is still precision point and you give it a name first <laughs> and uh, and then you can continue and and um, and create create new precision points now it'll give you the locations of each precision point this isn't the location that we want but what we will want to do is we want to uh, move the robot into position and then record the position point for that specific uh, location of the robot. Um, open up the jog manager, robot control, you'll need that later. When it's in the computer, that means that uh, the program is running. Uh, you'll want to switch to world or joint. Um, switch it to world. Move the robot some various location. You can see the locations listed up above. You can adjust the speed here for a quick moving. Put it in the location that you want. And then you come back to your precision point, the one that you want, and you select record. Now your precision point has the exact coordinates of that location. And then uh, you would just uh, adjust That was close. Adjust it to a new location. Go to your different precision point and choose record. And now it'll have those exact coordinates. You can see the coordinates are different.